And to Riggins, in to round a Monk, pitch back to Theisman, lets it go deep. He's got Charlie Brown down there, well covered. He makes the catch at the five and dives to the two. Charlie Brown, what an incredible catch. Hi, folks, and welcome to another edition of The Legacy. I'm your host, Doc Walker. Each week, we take you from the old school to the new with one thing in mind, and that is to win. And this week, folks, man, I'm thrilled to death to have one of the best to ever put the cleats on. He wore number 87, but in your program, he was number one. Charlie Brown, CB! What's going on, man? Man, it's great to be on your show, man. It's an honor. What happened in your career, and a lot of people don't realize that 1981, you missed the whole season. Absolutely. And so really in a short period of time, I can't think of few people that did more damage on the field than Charlie Brown. What do you attribute your ability to adapt so quickly and be a big impact player? Well, I think I was well coached in college, number one. And uh, I think I had a passion to be the very best. And uh, I think that just helped us so much and things that Coach Gibbs and the offense wanted me to do. I was very versatile. I was a very, very good blocker. And I just wanted to be the best and try to, you know, win a Super Bowl. Why did you always, for the most part, end up with the back-breaking play to send us to Super Bowls? Well, I guess it was just, you know, Coach Gibbs' system. And, um, you know, as you mentioned, you know, Art Mount. You know, Art was such a great, great receiver. And um, on any football team, the team that's going to win championships, you know, you need that, you know, that dynamite other guy on the other side. And uh, Coach Gibbs just had a lot of confidence in me. And uh, I knew my number was going to be called. And of course, you know, Joe Theismann had great confidence in me as well. And, you know, just the whole team, man. And uh, that just fired me up. Uh, fuel my passion to, you know, catch those balls and make the big plays. When you hear uh, downtown Charlie Brown, I'm thinking hoops. Yeah. How did you get that initial nickname? Well, actually, it started in college playing intramural basketball. And also, let me put a notation to this. A lot of people don't know this, but I was offered a basketball scholarship at South Carolina State, too, but I only chose to play football okay. and um, you know hooping was a part of my preparation for football as well but uh, you know I had a lot of great idols uh, David Thompson the Skywalker and you know I used to just like imitate him when I used to be on the basketball court and uh, it was a very passionate drive to be the best and it just carried over on the football field but man basketball I love basketball now Doc when I went to Atlanta, Bobby Butler said I was the best basketball player in the NFL. <laughs> Dude, I can't argue that. I, and I know some will get their feathers ruffled uh, when they hear this, but the John Booties of the world and all these guys who are still in great shape, man. I'm not hating on them. Yeah. But for my money, and we did have those, um, we had those charity basketball games Absolutely. against the Cowboys. We traveled. We had Absolutely. a traveling basketball great. game. Yeah. You are MJ and you know and, and Tony McGee. Now Tony thinks he's a ball, a ball on the basketball. That's why I love him so much, right? Side. Tony, get your behind in the paint. Okay, stop shooting them threes and get us some rebound. But we had a ball, you know, oh, doing we had a that. Great time, man. The legacy is brought to you by Janet King. Let Janet King get your business back to business. Visit to schedule a disinfecting service today. Don't let the comfort fool you. Don't let the attention to detail lead you to believe that a Honda is a delicate machine. <laughs> You'd be wrong. Underneath every surface that carries a Honda badge, there has always been the capacity to amaze. Rise to the challenge with the rugged performance of Honda. Don't miss the Honda 0% event. Well-qualified buyers can get a great deal, like 0% APR financing on the purchase of select Honda models. Hurry in or shop online. 
D.C. has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. D.C.'s greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94.7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive. Free health care. Hundreds to more than $1,000 per month in disability compensation and tens of thousands for college tuition. These are just some of the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs benefits that may be available to veterans. VA is focused on customer service like never before. Choose VA and see why veterans' trust in VA reached an all-time high. Claim the benefits you've earned at choose.va.gov. Dare we multiply the cash? Times 50? Times 100! At bonus cash. At second chance cash. Affirmative. We're up to a million. Whoa! <laughs> oh, it's working. Uh-oh. We must have over-multiplied. What's this? Yes! Play the five new X multiplier scratch-offs from the Maryland Lottery like nothing we've created before. Please play safely and responsibly. D.C. has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. D.C.'s greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94.7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive. We warmed up together. This, this line, this calisthenic line, people ask me all the time, how was the Fun Bunch created? Right. We created it in line, in calisthenics. Absolutely. Some of this stuff, you know, is classified. Right. But from that point, of the inception, we practicing and thinking about it all because James Arthur Monk had been injured. Right. You know, we trying to do something to celebrate art. It wasn't about us. Absolutely. It was about for art. Absolutely. And we're playing the Detroit Lions in the playoff game. And we planned this jump. We had all these practices there. <laughs> Alvin Garrett scores three times that day. Three. He forgot three. to That's jump good. on the first two. What right. do you remember about that? Well, I just remember when Art went down and it was like a tragedy, but you know, we had the motto, next man up. And Alvin was the next man up. And he was brilliant in that game, that playoff game against um, Detroit. And I remember the first time we jumped, which was that game. And you're right, the first two times, Alvin, what are you doing? We need to jump. So he ran off the field. field. Yeah, it happened, right. Yeah. And from that time, from that point on, it was history, man. We just couldn't wait to get in the end zone. It didn't matter who scored. We were going to fun bunch it in the end zone. Watching you and Virgil and Al run the four route, yeah. which for those the hip impaired is a square in. Right. Because all y'all had a patented move. And I can see Al up on his toes. You know, Virgil, you shimmying. And, and that shimmy, when you dropped your arms, and here's CB, his arms should have been six foot eight. And when, when you went into that shimmy shake, dude, I swear, I, I just, I can't contain it right now. What was that like? It's just being a part of that and how our fan base reacted to the smirch. Alvin and Virgil, man, I talk about these guys all the time because of their size. And, you know, because in football, everybody thinks you have to be so big. But I always talk about Alvin and Virgil. Those guys have some special qualities in their pass routes and in the demeanor and parts running pass routes. They were very gifted. They were fast. They were quick. They know how to avoid. Um, uh, they know how to make separation and avoid defenders at the line. And they just had a lot of great pride, you know, in, in running pass routes. And we just uh, mended very well together, being very small receivers, short in size, but big in stature as far as heart and desire is concerned. We all know when James Arthur was out, it was almost like, wait a minute, now they're going to double CB. Right. So what's going to happen to CB? I'll tell you what happened. CB went bug out once again at 787 wide cross knee. They never stopped you. The 49er yeah. game, the Cowboy game, the championship game, the bigger the game, none bigger than the Super Bowl, and once again, CB, you hit the end zone. Yeah, you know, I had a remarkable um, playoff run, you know, no in, doubt. in the history of the NFL, because I know at one point I was number two behind Cliff Branch and yardage, and uh, number two behind him as far as receptions, too. Until this day, I'm still ranked probably in the top five, top six. But man, playoff time was money time. 
you know, it was money time, it was time to perform. And that's when my talent came out, you know, very much the most was in the playoffs. And, um, and it still holds till today. You know, you got to show up for the playoffs. You know, you got to show up for the big game. And if you don't, man, you just another fish in the sea. <laughs> of all the things and all the crowds and all the games, what is Charlie Brown's favorite moment in burgundy and gold? Well, you have to uh, want to say the Super Bowl, but in a line with that, you know, all the playoff games, man, because those playoff games was big, you know, I had big time games. Uh, but I got to say the Cowboys, man. You know, other than the Super Bowl, it's all of the Cowboys games, every last one of them, because, you know, we never wanted to lose to those guys. You know, never. We never yeah. wanted to. And I thought that, you know, Coach Gibbs and his staff and, and us, we, done, we did such a great job to take that reign from the Dallas Cowboys, and we were dominant. You know, we owned them in the 80s. No doubt about that, my friend. And um, I think about that Corvette you had, that customized <laughs> vet. Dude, I loved it. You drove that thing on the practice field one day. I almost lost my mind. The Legacy is presented by your local Nissan dealers. Now it's easier than ever to play the DC Lottery. With iLottery, you can play online anytime. We all know things are different. Keeping you safe is not. At Innova, we ensure the safety of everyone who comes to us with safe locations, safe supplies, safe cleaning, and safe practices. You're safe at Innova. Get the facts at innova.org safety. When was the last time you experienced something different? Did you know that Geico's whole 15 minutes thing? <laughs> that came from me. Really, my first idea was in one quarter of an hour, your savings will tower. Uh, over you, figuratively speaking. But that's not catchy, is it? It's not going to swim about in your brain. So I thought, what about 15 minutes, 15%? Serendipity. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. We all know things are different. Keeping you safe is not. At Innova, we ensure the safety of everyone who comes to us with safe locations, safe supplies, safe cleaning, and safe practices. You're safe at Innova. Get the facts at innova.org safety. Now it's easier than ever to play the DC Lottery. With iLottery, you can play online anytime. What do you miss most about the good days? Well, I miss the guys. You know, I miss you guys, man. Uh, we were just like a family. Uh, I just can't remember where we had any animosity, not one. And it's probably the only football team in my entire life where we didn't have any animosity. Uh, everybody loved each other. It didn't matter who got the publicity or who scored the touchdown, you know, or who was the MVP. Um, we were just a close-knit family, man, and it's nothing like brotherhood. I mean, it's nothing like brotherhood, even in today's society. You know, I wish everybody in society can feel the way we felt uh, playing with the Washington uh, football team back uh, in the day. We, I think, really demonstrated teamwork at the highest level. A lot of people talk about it, but I really believe that we lived it and we believed it. And and that is something to me is prideful in seeing that, you know, we weren't just a one trick pony. Uh, we just hit and run, but it has sustained, you know, throughout the years. And my brother, the best is yet to come. And, and I believe that. I, I thank you, man, so much. You know, I love you and I appreciate you doing this, man. And I can't wait to do it again. Man, I love you too, Rick, man. And I uh, can't wait to see you. And, 
you know, hang out with you like the olden days, man, and just catch up on a lot of things. But yeah, I'm right here in Florence, South Carolina, man. When you need me, you know, my, you got my number. So just give me a call. But it's been a pleasure and an honor to be on your show and to uh, yeah. represent Washington. My man. Well, thank you. Well, that's going to do it this week, folks, for our edition of The Legacy. Um, as Coach Thompson said on a regular basis, CB is just simply one of the best. That'll do it for this week. Everybody be safe. Mask up. Keep your social distance because I want to see you next week. Mm -hmm.